What is up guys, welcome back to another play review. Today we're going to be looking at second and form McCormack. Now I want to let you guys know before this whole review begins, his shooting, oh my goodness, it is just so overpowered for a 77 overall. It's like you're shooting with a team of the year player or even a legend. So he, I don't even know what to say. Imagine this guy gets a third in form. His shot already feels like a 99 shot on his card. I mean, in game, it is just so stupid. When you're shooting the ball, if the goalkeeper saves it, it's like he's going into the back of the net with the ball. Anyway, if you guys are looking for a cheap and reliable place to get your coin, check out battle.com. The link will be in the description. Use the code Itani to get 5% off. Now, other than his shooting, you guys want to know what else is great. But I can't tell you guys enough if you love to shoot if you're awesome at long shots second inform McCormack will be ideal for you now as you guys know you know my place are I like to take long shots a lot during matches even during pink slips or wager matches I just love taking long shots because I find them very effective in this game and with second inform McCormack it is just so overpowered and I can't tell you guys enough if you if that's your sort of play style you would have to try this guy out he has full star weak foot he has decent heading in game I mean his in-game stats don't show he has amazing heading or anything like that he did score me a couple of headers um, really good finesse shots from outside the penalty area you'll score you'll see me score a really nice one from like 40 yards out um, he's a very good finisher okay dribbler sometimes he feels stiff because his ball control isn't the best so you won't be able to dribble very easily past defenders unless you're at least good at dribbling if you're good at dribbling you might be able to but sometimes I do find it hard to dribble past defenders he has decent pace and that's what I mean imagine he gets a third in form or a team of the season card this guy is going to be an amazing team of the season card if he dis well if EA decides to give him one so three star skills is a disadvantage I mean I know some of you would be saying oh you don't even use that but it's for you guys in general he has three star skills so it's for you guys that use skills he only has three star skills he is also out of position sometimes so you won't always find him effective on the counter attack and even when you're just playing normally he's not always in position in that striker role so you might find him ideal in the uh, in the center attack and midfielder role because if you love to take shots with your center attack and midfielder this guy is basically ideal for you so I was thinking of moving him down to a center attack and midfielder role but for me I am actually gonna keep second in for McCormack his silver upgrade to a gold his shooting the upgrade is a huge difference you have to purchase him and try him out to know exactly what I'm talking about now if you don't like to shoot if you're more of a clinical finisher and you always have to be in the penalty area to finish then you might not like second in form McCormack because I think that should be his selling point it probably is his selling point which is his shooting so for me he's an ideal player I'm going to be keeping him in my club probably moving him down as a center attacker midfielder but that is all there is to it for this player review you could expect packing the jackpot later on today guys and maybe a second in form Schneider tomorrow but let me know what would you want to see alongside the second in form Schneider review tomorrow what other plays is there left from this team of the week you would love to see me review and hope you guys enjoyed it if you did i'd really appreciate a like and i hope you guys have a very nice day